In this video, we're going to walk through how to transfer your case to a different team within your functional group. When I'm here in the case list view, if I see, based on the subject line, that this case still belongs to my functional group, but it just needs to be transferred to a different team, I'm going to open the case and change the category. To open a case, I can either click on the case number or the subject line. In this example, I'm going to click on the subject line. Your case will either open in the case feed view or in the case details. I know I'm in the case feed because this icon is highlighted and because I can see the post, ability to email, or attach a file to this case. However, in order to change the category, I need to be on the case details. To access the case details, I'm going to click on the case details icon. Once I'm in the case details, I'm going to review and confirm that there is content in the subject line and the description. I won't be able to make any changes to this case if the subject line and description are not complete. Now that I've confirmed that the subject line and the description are complete, I can move through my process of changing the category. When I hover over the category field, a little pencil will appear in the right. I can double click on this little pencil to open the dependent fields. From here, I came to change my category. I'm going to select the appropriate category this case needs to go to. And then I'm going to click OK. When I click anywhere on the screen, you'll notice that the content in my category field is orange. If I leave the screen, the changes I've made will not have saved. Before I leave the screen, I need to be sure to save my changes. Now I can be assured that this case will be handled by the appropriate team. It's owned by my functional group, and it has the appropriate category for the team that needs to handle or address this case. To return to the main service console and continue working cases, the fastest way is to click this drop down in the upper right corner and choose Close All Primary Tabs. To see the changes reflected here in the caseless view, remember that you'll need to refresh the screen. I can also go to the other caseless view to see that the case has been transferred here. Now I'll see that the case that I recently changed the category for is now in the appropriate caseless view for the team that needs to manage that case. That concludes this video on how to transfer your case to a different team within your functional group.